Hi everybody, we're going to do an Impossible Creatures um, cast. I don't know, what do you call something that's not a live cast? Uh, None of them are actually live casts. <laughs> <laughs> that's not true. Oh, there you go. I guess it's just the cost of a game. I it's don't a replay know. commentary. Replay there. There we go. you go. That's what I'm looking for. Um, this was a game between me. I'm green. Um, Buddyus, who is cyan. Steve Kyan. is red, as always. Ooh. And Piano Man is our special guest for today in blue. Sadly, none of us here commentating except for me and Steve were actually in the game, but. Noel's here because he's fun and keeping us here because we need him to record stuff, so... <laughs> wow. Yeah, say hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hi. Um, might as well get this underway. Yeah. I like how you can see it building against me. Yeah. It's got the, it's got the lion face for something. It's got the line face for everything, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. But I mean, it makes sense the least for henchmen, I would expect. Yeah, okay. I've been looking at that line face recently, and it's really bizarre if you just look at it. It is, yeah. It's, not, it's almost like some kind of weird skeleton thing. It's really not right. I was really hoping you were going to say something sarcastic, like it's almost, it's like some weird kind of combination of two creatures. Oh, for fuck's sake, but it no, doesn't it... actually look like that. It no, kind of does. It, it, it kind of looks like um like a lion with a bull's nose. That's what you look like. I know. Thank you. Was that a compliment? I basically am Sigma. Rex Chance at your service. Then I'm uh, then I'm happy that Rex uh, quoted in one of uh, one of the missions we have to destroy Sigma. Oh. Hey, look, it's me. Oh, for fuck's sake, mm. henchman. <laughs> Get in there. <laughs> <laughs> run away, run away. I was really pleased to see that Paul spawned next to me because um, uh, Paul, aka Piano Man, is like, he's the best player in this game by a long way. He's mm. much better than me, Steve. So, I decided to... Alright, I've beat him before. A few times. Yeah. Okay. Well, I definitely remember him being infinitely better than me. He was definitely a lot better than us when he was on Skype. Yeah, true. That was before the days of ICO for you. Oh, for fuck's sake. Armchair fans. Oh, this is where Buddyus tries to take mid. You mean tries? Well, he succeeds <laughs> for a little bit. What's a little bit? I like um I like back in Paul's base. He saw my henchman go back into the water, and he set up a sound beam tower just in case of an attack. <laughs> oh, Paul! Holy, holy, Paul! Oh, boy! Holy, Paul! You know what's a bad name? Pauline is a bad name. Why is Pauline a bad yeah. name? It's just it's terrible. It's like it's almost as bad as Geraldine. Oh yeah, that's also. Awesome. Well, uh, oh, my the best. dad, uh, a Thanks. common, <laughs> a common Dutch name for a uh, man is uh, Geert, and my aunt uh, is Geertina. Ew. And my and my Geert. Geert. And but the weird thing is, <laughs> my uncle, uh, his name is Geert, and my aunt's name is Geertina. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, that's yeah. G-E-R-T. Uh, G-E-E-R-T, yeah. yeah. Someone's gonna skip to this point in the replay and just think there's like a family of mooses with bronchitis. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna stop doing that noise, noise now because it's just static over the microphone. Yeah, good yeah. <laughs> No more Dutch. Okay, okay, okay. It wasn't really Dutch though. It's more like just it's... pronunciation of names. That's a Dutch pronunciation of name. Of name. There you go. Yeah, okay, you got me there. Knew it. Sure. Sure. Uh, you said Booty has succeeded for a little bit. Oh yeah, he's there. Doing, <laughs> a, doing a final job. I mean, he's got three hench, so he's not really making the most of what he's got. He has five, six hench? Six, I think. Yeah, six. Sorry, I don't know how to count. 
I can't work out what that fucking lion head is. Oh, it's I really can't. The hairy dyn. Yeah, but what is this in the background? In Milling the background. ominously. <laughs> oh look, they're, they're meeting each other. They're smelling oh, each God. other's butts. Nice. Oh go. god, they're in the background. Oh fuck's sake, I just noticed. It's gonna happen. The carnage. Ba ba ba. Pure carnage. I like how. Uh... This is the most frustrating thing you've ever done. I am the children. <laughs> what about that one time we crepes and captured the flag? Oh, That's for also pretty frustrating. That was pretty fucking frustrating. Can't save you now. I thought you were gonna cry. <laughs> I'm so pissed I, I, that you called it Surf and Turf. It's either Butterflump or it's, um... Calm Down, I think? What was Kiki, what was the other name of that? Be Pacified. Be Pacified, yeah. That's it. And I'm Calm Down were the uh, Walrus uh, Men Awards. Yeah, of course. My second favorite songs. You know what What was funny? Um, when we, uh, I think it was a sixth player on Deep? I don't know, actually. But um, Booty has had like an upgraded carnage and called it catastrophe. That was pretty funny. Steve, how much do those rattlesnake giant ant eaters cost? Well, let me just pull up my army and check. <laughs> <laughs> pull up the stats. Two forty-four coal over one seventeen electricity. It's less electricity than I thought. Hmm. I guess. Meanwhile, that's why I wouldn't use it. Yeah, the carnage is real there. I wasn't really gonna destroy his lab, I just wanted him to send his henchmen to repair it rather than build more creature chambers, so I got it down to like half health. Oh, look, fake, fake creeps. creeps. Ooh. Yeah, fake creeps. Those really hurt my feelings. Oh, what is that? <laughs> They're called what is that like? Oh, it's a Jansu. Little Jansu. <laughs> you know, you wanna know the best thing about carnage though? What? 38 coal, 18 electricity. Jesus Christ. That's seven melee upgraded with pack that gets up to what ten point five, and then with frenzy it's like twenty one. Is that right, Steve? Uh, I think it's something like that. Oh, I love those units from Steve, like the Rhino Cobras. Fucking oh yeah, those are beautiful. <laughs> Great. Please, I can explain. <laughs> Do they actually work, or is it just fun? I'm gonna let Steve answer that one. Yeah, that's what I'm asking. Uh, Steve? Uh, hello? It's alright, I got it. <laughs> Is Steve still here? Maybe he just hates you. Sometimes he says that, he says, God, I just hate no. Who doesn't? Oh no. <laughs> no, I'm sure I know. the Rhino would love you. I, I know you don't hate me, Will. We have well, I have a picture together. of you on my wall and I lick it every night. I have a picture of you above my bed and I pray to it when I go to sleep. Oh! Yeah, but do you lick it? That's the uh, worship I demand. I have a foot fetish with it. Oh, cool. Neat. How does that work with a poster? I have a full body poster. <laughs> it's got an answer for everything, this boy. <laughs> Oh, these fucking cobras. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> cobra vs. Cobra, though. <laughs> Did someone just drop? Yeah, Steve's internet went out. So, he'll be back in a sec. Yeah. Uh, fucking Buddy is taking out my geyser. And I couldn't stop him. Those rams are pretty beast, actually. The barrier destroy, man. Which one? Cost a lot of yeah, the, the, the ram lobster, they do cost a lot of electricity. Oh, yeah, yeah. I used them before. I was not too fond of it, to be honest. And there's carnage, annihilated. As is carnage's purpose. The, um, the candle that burns twice as bright burns half as long. Yeah, okay, never mind. Yes, that's the court. Isn't it half as long, twice as bright, instead of twice as bright, bright half as long? 
No, I think it's burns twice as bright, burns half as long. Huh. I think. Because I know uh, I played Infamous 2 lately, and uh, the guy that's your best friend, like in that game, quotes that. And I think he says, uh, "Have as long." I he, he, he like says, um, "Have a stall uh, twice as bright," or something like that. I'll, I'll just search for it. I I'll see if it's online. Don't again. care. Look at these fucking anteaters. This is I like snake bites. Anteaters versus cobras. That's good. Carnage though. Yeah, well, carnage is basically cardigans. Okay, cardigans are fucking. They're my bays. Even though they're three hundred coal and one hundred fifty electricity, which is kind of a lot. Hmm. It's not so bad at level four, but it's not great. But I mean, they don't even give a fuck about this artillery. Yeah, that's the nice thing, and the nice thing is that they're pretty good in melee as well. You want to know the actual nice thing, though? What? 300 health upgraded. Oh my god, fuck that. Exactly me. 300. Hey, Steve, you're back. Hey, uh, Steve. Yeah, the internet was it, had to take its daily shit. Was it the Cougar? Oh, Jesus. Was it the what? The Cougar. Steve's got a Cougar in his area at the moment. <laughs> oh, oh, really? Multiple Cougars. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Please uh, <laughs> mute your mic if you can. Oh yeah, mute, mute yeah. your Skype mic. Oh, yeah. Goodness me. It does Absolute get really nice back. Okay, so what's going on now? Well, we went through the rhino snakes. Um, how do you feel about the rhino snakes, by the way? I, oh, I like them. I don't, but that might just be because they're hilarious. <laughs> yeah, are they any good though? <laughs> See, this, okay, this is Steve's beluga attacking Steve's other beluga. Yeah. <laughs> He fucking deserves it. <laughs> okay, so the snakes, the rhino snakes are 197 over 63. They have 219 health and 14 melee damage with horns at level 3. I think that's pretty good. Oh, that's hmm. pretty good, I guess. That, that's not too and bad. They only that's have 17 cool. speed, but they have charge attack with their two little rhino legs. Yeah, which is adorable. <laughs> they wiggle really fast when they charge. Give us a look at your um your level 5 now, Steve. Alright, so Specifically, we have... Grandpa Sharpneck. We've got Grandpa Sharpneck, which is a man of war with a warthog. It costs 287 coal for level 5. 122 <laughs> that's, electricity. That's actually, that's less than crepes. I mean, not crepes, fucking um, cardigans at level 4. It's less yeah, than my, my level, level 4 range. My level 4 is actually more expensive. Right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, it has 329 health. And does 36 melee with horns, but it doesn't matter because I can make a million of them. It has herding, poison touch, poison tip, keen sense, conglomerate, and horns. That's fucking brutal. Quantity over quality, right? And conglomerate, by the way, if you're just tuning in or if you're not really used to Tellurian means... Um, we made it so that big animals take up more population space than small animals, but conglomerate means that whatever it is, however big, it only takes one population space. So basically, yeah. he can make 250 of these little motherfuckers, and he nearly does. It's the same <laughs> as Colony, right? Yeah, or, yeah it is. Colony, it's except yeah, conglomerates yeah. on the torso, Colony's on the head. I'm yeah, thinking okay. about programming in some other differences as well, but we can't do too much. We don't have much flexibility. How about these fellas, Steve? Which ones? I'm still looking at my army. The frog. Well, the, the poison frack whale. Poison frack. Yeah, I didn't change the name because frack is funny, but... <laughs> 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 anyway... They cost 677 coal and 119 electricity. They have 1,004 health unupgraded. Which is fucking brutal. And 21 damage with tongue attack. They also have herding because they're humpback whales. That's so cool. the thing that... They're really slow, though, on land. That is true, but they crawl. I like watching frogs crawl. Makes okay. me feel powerful. Um, fucking just can't more... hop now, can ya? Yeah, well, dude, fucking one big. Are the, are the belugas, right? Cheap this cool. one has 120, I mean 1,020 health unupgraded, and it does 13 damage without water artillery, but it also has Frenzy, which brings it up to 26. 26 um, artillery damage is pretty fucking lethal, especially because you can upgrade the PS damage. And it's on, and that's the unupgraded stat. Let's check out um And it costs 505, Steve. 131. 505 is honestly not too bad. Steve has just taken out the South Island where Piano Man used to be. Look at all those fucking hogs. God damn it. 
Get all these henchmen. All the fucking henchmen. God damn. Well, killed because they just went and hit oh, all we're shorts almost, temporarily. We're almost to the fucking nav hole bit. Yeah. <laughs> we'll, um, we'll pause when we get up to that and we'll have a good explanation if it makes sense later on. Uh, Will, can you explain your cheaplings then? If we're busy explaining. I can. Look, I love piranhas. Piranhas are like the best creature in the game as far as I'm concerned. Because look at the little humpbacks and their adorable little fins. But they also have <laughs> Pack Hunter and Frenzy. They're the only creature that has that and they do like. As a result, they, um, they multiply damage by like three, which is just lethal. Cheaplings are like 278 coal and 111 electricity, so they're basically three at level five. And they, they do don't have conglomerate. They do twenty-two damage, which with horn with um with pack and frenzy goes up to like sixty-six. Jesus. Um, and then they have horns as well, which is just crazy. I mean, they've got nothing in terms of health or defense, but um. And what I about? Mean, and what about the? Yeah, exactly. <gasps> Forty feet of pure nudity. Yeah. Probably my favorite creature at the moment, because okay, okay, look. I'll level with you. It costs 1,000 coal, <laughs> which is, that's too much. You should not use level 5 if it costs 1,000 coal, but because I have also really, really cheap level 5s, I can hold everybody off with cheaplings and then just like drip create 40 feet of pure nudity at like a rate of 1 every minute or 2. It doesn't drain my economy too much. Because they've got colony, from there I've got 12 million. Here, pause here, would you? Kiki. Pause. <laughs> yeah, just toggle pause a lot, that's good. Go to my base. Okay, okay, let me explain what just happened. Steve was attacking my lab. If you click on it, you can see... It's got... Yeah, he, he got it down to less than 900 health, so it was literally one second away from death. And then, um, if you go back to the island where Piano Man used to be... Um, okay, see that one... <laughs> <laughs> okay, see that's that... That's great. That one workshop there with like no health left. Um, when Steve was attacking my lab, uh, I sent him a message that said, "Oh, Labby," with a sad yeah, face. He called and, Labros um, like a dick. <laughs> <laughs> and Steve was like, "Oh no, I better not kill his lab because that would be a lab rush." Um, because I technically still had a base, but I didn't really have a base. I had one workshop and three offshore creature chambers. So really, if Steve did kill me, that would have been totally fair, but he didn't, because he's a prince, and a gentleman, and a much scholar, of a good guy. and a beautiful, beautiful woman who I would love to smother with margarine. Okay, calm down, just tell us to go. <laughs> so that's the reason why Steve just almost destroyed my lab, but then stopped. Basically, TLDR is he's a good person. Oh look, not. there's another henchman contemplating the class. <laughs> I think he's considering suicide, to be honest. By drowning. He's just watched. He's just watched his entire base get erased by a swarm of warthogs. He's just gonna jump in the ocean. I think. Got, like, oh god, another one is about to join him. I've got at this stage like ten structures in the whole fucking game. I'm basically out. He's what is got, the, what Budius doing actually? What is Budius doing? He loves it when we pronounce it Budius. By the way. Yeah. If anyone, if anyone ever meets him online, just call him Budius. What is it actually? Because I heard like a load of names. I think it's Buddy's, it's right? Buddy's. It's Buddy's. Yeah. It's. I mean, it's Bud. You know. Yes. Like a Bud. Because I, I, I heard uh, Buddy's then. I heard Booty's, like Booty, and I heard Butt's with a K. What the fuck? I think okay, you're that's the only one. That's, that's just weird. All right, that's Metabulate. He's um he's using Old Faithful, the best artillery unit. 500 coal, 100 electricity. Um, really good probably, range. Probably the unit I've used most out of all units ever. Well, what makes it good is that it's combined with a giant squid, so it has regeneration. So you can hover oh, yeah. them in and out of battle. And they'll regenerate Except if health. they're in battle, then you're fucked up because they're a long range artillery. Yeah, um, but because of the hover, you don't get in. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> It's an amphibious centipede. <laughs> oh god. Well, look and at that look, look at that one on the, the end running the, away. In the, <laughs> and in the front, like an alien xenomorph is bursting out of the chest. Yeah, that's true, nice. Wow, great pause. Oh look at that hop. Oh that's majestic. <laughs> that's that's a perfect pause there. Look at the little fangs the frog's got. Alright, um a great screenshot. I'm really bothered by this because frogs. Make, don't that, have the, teeth. make that the thumbnail. Like yeah, like that. Make it the thumbnail. 
That's a cool <laughs> thumbnail. You're a cool thumbnail. Thanks a lot. I call my right thumbnail Null so I can clip it every month. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Also, I like I like Buddyus's level five. It's the um, Behemoth Great White. No idea how much it costs, but it was very annoying. All game, it just bothered the shit out of me. Resume game. Yeah, let's get it back. I think the only reason Steve didn't now immediately roll south and destroy me is because Buddy has started to worry him. Yeah, Buddy has came in with his artillery and oh, started summoning mid. Look at these little chieflings. <laughs> I just love the little hornets like they have. I know, it's adorable. There's nothing makes more adorable units than piranhas. Piranhas and giant anteaters, which is why crepes are the best unit in the world. Oh man, watch, watch these frogs now. Watch the... Which Ooh. one? Oh. Oh, 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 here we go. Oh, yeah, you're gonna retreat. Alright, get on. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, get, get that one. Get that. Get him, get him, get him. Oh. The frog stumble is just the best. Meanwhile, Steve and Buddy are just scrapping there. Hmm. Buddy has, like, nothing through the whole game, and yet neither of us can manage to kill him. I know, we both try, eventually. Eventually he's taken out by the weather, of all things, but we'll get to that soon. <laughs> what? Okay, I want to see that. The I do weather. love the, the Beluga Wolverines, I really do. The thing I love about them is that they do so much damage, and they have so much health, that they can beat Glassy Melee, like they can beat Cheaplings. If you send yeah. a Cheapling Swarm at them, you can just let Friendly Fire hit your own units, you don't even need to micro and the cheaplings will die, like five waves or cheaplings will die before the first wave of Belucas does. There's, it's weird, they're such an obvious unit to make, but they're way better than you'd expect. Mm -hmm. What's, uh, oh, Buddy is also using electric eel behemoth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He is. Yeah, those are a classic, to be honest. Yeah, I, I saw them walking around, but I wasn't sure. Boop, 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 boop. I still there is a satisfying thing to watch, I enjoy. What am I doing over on this? Oh, cheap. Oh, what, what would you say is the best uh, class of like creature? Melee, ranged, or artillery? It's There's hard no... to say. It's designed so that one's no, none, none of them are better than the others. But yeah, but I mean, what, 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 what suits your playstyle more? In... Like, what do you like more? It's tricky because a while ago it definitely would have been artillery because mostly metabolites. But um, now I'm just loving the spam. Spam melee, man, it's so great. Especially with these new warthogs Steve just invented. Yeah. Spam range. <laughs> I think spam I range, yeah, true. four in the army builder, but I never had the balls to save them. Yeah, I understand. They're like super glossy level fives. But they do work. When the the thing that shits me is I've got rhino piranhas, he's got warthog man of wars. On paper, like, that should not be a contest, but he just decimates me with it. By the way, you probably don't want to do what I'm doing here and have every single one of your henchmen off building sound beams. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I like to call the good old-fashioned Peterson Panic. <laughs> you got a micro. A yeah, micro Kiki, you. actually, Kiki's hench micro is on point. You won't see that in this game, but, um... <laughs> oh, you'll probably see it in some other games. Are these uh, condors any good? I don't know. How Flying much damage? 26. Look, 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 a... look at the Lone Ranger. That's a condor. <laughs> Enough that. Oh shit, now he's destroying. Oh no, look at all these fucking bad guys. Look at all those bastards. This, is, this begins a um, long and frustrating sequence in the Will and Steve chapter. Constantly, on, it's always ongoing. It's basically, <laughs> no <laughs> end. <laughs> oh Jesus! Sneaky nudity. <laughs> you need to, you need to hide your nudes so that nobody can see them. It's very important. That's a nice I, candid nude. The, the, the funny thing <laughs> is that I actually think that that was your whole point behind that unit, naming it nudity, but making it uh, able to dig, so you could say, "Oh, you have to hide your nudity." All naked mole rats can dig. Come now. Now, I mean, I mean, like that. 
I think that was the whole point of you making that unit. So you you know that. I would never hide my nudity. <laughs> I'm only hiding my nudity so that I can surprise Steve with it when he least expects. Why is there no team color on these? Um, I don't know. It looks oh, like the that's actually that's quite a good question. The ball must be hidden inside the torsos. That's interesting. Huh. Bombardment! Bombardment! Fun fact for the boys at home, if you want to get nice screenshots, you can actually turn the team color buff by typing team color hide. Just like that. Yep. Thanks, camera Kiki. That is nice, really, isn't it? Yeah. And then you can then type wow. team look, color show to bring them back. Look at those nude bombardier beetles. That looks so weird with that team color. Okay, here's me attacking Buddyus. I think I missed this when I watched it. Okay, Look at all those little cheaplings. But um, he outclassed the cheaplings, sadly. I've been wondering, is that, does every structure take the same amount of time to build? Um, no, I no, don't believe they, so. No, they all have different build times. You can check it in the lures. I wonder which one takes more. Uh, workshop takes a fucking long time for one hench alone. Air chambers take air chambers build super fast. Yeah, super for some yeah, air yeah. chambers. Build for some fast. reason, yeah, I don't really understand that. We should probably adjust it. It makes this makes spamming flyers easier. Yeah. To be honest, maybe it's a good idea to just George. put like all the creature chambers on the same build time. Yeah. Like that it, even. It's not like something like that should upset anybody, really. You know. Oh, but no, I think I think. Like, the only ones that are gonna notice it are us and the guys that are watching this video. Well, I think most people probably notice the air chambers. It's really fast. It's nice, actually. I enjoy it. The yeah, wings just pop I up and just it. slip on. Ooh, is this, is this the frog massacre, Steve? I think it is. <laughs> Might be. <laughs> oh, I hope so. It wouldn't surprise me. Here we go. No. Okay, this is, this is pretty much an equal number of frogs versus cheaplings. Maybe a couple more cheaplings. Why are you treating? Oh, okay, yeah. He's trying to line me up. Nice camera work, Kiki. I've got that volley. No, oh, that comes the north, 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 the pincer attack! Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the nice thing about that is, even though we had more or less number of units, it cost me like 2,000 coal, and it cost Steve like 10,000 coal. His buddy is. What is he doing? Look at all this so fucking combo rules. I love regen flyers, but I don't like range flyers. Putting yeah, range on flyers is it's really not that useful. Yeah, oh, here we go. Oh, look at the nudity versus Beluga. How <laughs> <laughs> long it took them to kill him. Huge nude, small Belugas. Ooh, oh, this is where he lab rushed me. Oh, yeah, he Steve's like. Steve's like, wow. um. In chat, he was like, "Oh, buddy, yes, don't lab rush me," and that made me sad because I didn't want Steve to get lab rushed. So I started building a whole bunch of water chambers so that I could attack Buddyus, save Steve for whatever fucking reason. I don't know what I was thinking. I think mostly I felt guilty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no guys are for you. Do I want guys? Nah. He doesn't actually attack my lab for a while, but when he, but he all he killed were like my research clinics. <laughs> yeah, he's he's a sea snake and Yeah, there it goes. Oh, oh. never mind. Hmm. That was probably like the Wait, moment yeah. I called lab rush. Yeah, I was it like a hawk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he had lab defense, so he was kinda of fucked anyway. And I think Will is building the what yeah yeah, Will's building water chambers. Here we go. I suddenly saw like this green blob running over the map. That's how I'm often described by my friends. Uh, That's how I pop up in Google Maps actually. If you happen to be looking at like a map of Edinburgh on Google Maps and I'm on the move, you'll just see this little green splodge. <laughs> I'll, just, uh, I'll just hide team colour so you won't see it. Okay, what Steve should have done there is just left his artillery standing there. Because even, yeah. even melee, but... they will probably beat cheaplings. It's just that every fiber of my being says not to pit melee against artillery, because normally you don't want to do that. <laughs> yep, normally it's a terrible idea. 
but in this case... I'd probably have done the same, to be completely honest. I've done it way too many times. So, what I expected yeah, here was that I was just going to spam a whole bunch of cheaplings and roll Buddyus. Just, like, paste him into the ground, like... Bob K is now playing something something dollar money. Pound him like yeah. yesterday's beef, but it just didn't happen. I wanna pound you like yesterday's beef! <laughs> <laughs> it's not a nice replays video without Mighty Boosh quotes. Yeah, that's true. And there's Metabulates from Buddyus in my base as a sneaky but very audacious counterattack. I like his style. I remember when I could steal big Buddyus. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Back in the day. All right, this is this attack coming up is like my favorite engagement of the whole game, to be honest. Uh, which one, yours or uh, Steve? Steve is attacking me. I don't attack. You know me. I'm a fucking coward. Uh, in the, I mean, like in the above bit what of the map. Why did I pull them back? What the fuck? I think you were massing. Oh, you were, you were bringing sharp necks around the north. I just just kept them there, to be honest. Kept them attacking. Yeah. I mean, they have like twelve hundred health. It's okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just look at those two Rhino Cobras just chilling there, guarding the base. I just sent a... Oh, here we go. They're oh, crunch. crunch! You know nothing of the crunch. <laughs> oh, here we go again! Crunch this! Crunch <laughs> them! It's always about the crunch! <laughs> <laughs> I really, I hate watching, um, I hate watching artillery. Because the artillery just shelled both of our melee combatants, and both of our sides were just annihilated. Hey, buddy is. But here's the cheeky oh, nudes. Oh God. <laughs> but nobody protects the cheeky uh, nudes. Discord. Blocked them off in the back with some hover range. Sometimes I predict the cheeky nudes. Hi, Logan. What's up? I always I'm predict the cheeky off. nudes. That one just frog. reset internet to an old like 2003 desktop. Oh, it's buddy. Wow, nice. <laughs> hey buddy, yes, we're watching the game that you're in, but you're about to not be in it. Oh yeah. Wow, great reaction. Oh yeah. Nice. Nice meme. Marco memes. I'm gonna steal it. Oh, anyway, gonna that, steal my memes. That, that, All original content. I'm gonna steal that meme. You have the weirdest Italian accent I've ever heard. Do it again. <laughs> what? what Noel, seduce me. Like you were an Italian man. Go, give it your best shot. Oh, Hate Christ. me like one of your Italian girls. <laughs> With spaghetti Steve. dripping out of my mouth. Steve, <laughs> get over here. I want to paint you like one of my Italian girls. What is that? Why am I getting West African? West African? Really? I can hear a West African when you talk. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, I don't know. Because he secretly speaks Afrikaans. Oh, that's true. I think it's uh like w we had this conversation in the in the morning. Like it's my accent, I think. Cuz I also talk a lot um just English a lot different than the other uh, Dutch guys. A little bit, yeah. Noticeably. Not in a bad yeah. way. No, but I just think it's just my accent. Because I come you from the... Oh, look at those sharp necks getting burst. The Caribbean Netherlands. Shit. Caribbean Good. Netherlands. <laughs> I'll probably die there, because it's too hot. Alright, let's, um... Steve, is it almost time for Buddyus to depart, depart this mortal coil? I don't remember. I think it must be getting close. <laughs> Just imagine that somebody dies, and then... Like, in real life, and then oh, you ask... I still think... You ask Steve, like, hey, when did uh, when did Logan die? Well, I honestly really, don't remember. It'll be really obvious when it <laughs> when it happens. Yeah, I'd like to get a good shot of it, but I suppose it doesn't matter. He could just hover over the base for the le uh, for the remainder of the game and just watch it. I love watching cover and just... No. Oh, it hurts my feelings because it's so tense. Oh, it didn't even kill him. <laughs> you can see them arching through the air for like 40 oh, fucking oh, seconds, oh. and then the target moves at the last oh, second. second. Look at this, look at this. Oh. Oh. No. Oh, God. Boop, 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 boop. Our arrows will block out the sky. It's really satisfying watching the little shadows go. 
Yeah, I agree. Yeah. They didn't used to be a thing. We actually enabled those, believe it or not, Intel. Before Tel, projectiles had no shadows, so there you go. I honestly didn't know that. that Nobody does. A... Mine equals blown. Nice one. Thanks. Steve, you have anything to uh, contribute? <laughs> <laughs> this was a really this intense match, you guys. Yeah, it was. It was fucking mental. Poor uh, piano man, though. <laughs> no way, I wanted to, I had to choose to get tarnished and it was always going to be Paul. I mean, he never would have expected me to attack because in all the games we played together I've always just turtled. And now that I've got this wonderful new weapon, this super weapon, this um, big long blue bag of cocks. Did another that one is an introduction. <laughs> hey, Luke. Uh, hey, Luke. <laughs> Luke, you want to hear about my big long blue bag of cocks? Yes. <laughs> you would. You've already seen it, to be honest. Yeah, because Will's always nude, he just told me. Basically, <laughs> I'm nude right now. Just Will, it, Will is 40 nude, feet though. of pure nudity. I'm like six and a half feet of pure nudity, lying down. What about standing up? <laughs> I'm like an accordion. When I stand up, I'm like three feet. <laughs> you should see me go downstairs. He's one of those like spring things you put on the stairs, like when exactly. <laughs> That's the check dot jpeg. Oh man, and these have keen sense too. Yeah, they have keen sense, so they can see my nudity wherever it should hide. How much did a pussy does this cost? Who has keen sense? The warthogs. Oh yeah, yeah. Steve. <laughs> Grandpa Sharpnack. Very special sense. Sharp. Grandpa Sharpnack. This one ends in there. Wasn't the Jim Waters second name or something like that? Grandpa Sharpnack? RPG fun is now playing Impossible Creatures. Oh, by the way, yeah, Luke's, Luke's here now, everyone. You probably noticed. Yeah, we said, I said hi. I love like how hi. people keep on doing this cast. It's amazing. Hello. Oh yeah, we're a, we're a community operation here. Yeah. We're fucking popular. World famous. And by that you mean Take we're not picture. popular yet, but we're screwing Could you Don't people. tell them that. <laughs> god. <laughs> Jesus Christ, look. <laughs> Jesus, what do you do? Oh my god, look at that little snake. <laughs> look at the wiggle. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. wiggle. The a run animation on these fuckers whoop, just makes, whoop, whoop, makes whoop, life whoop, worthwhile. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> <laughs> With two legs. Imagine if that walking cycle was realistic. It would just smack his head down to the ground every time it walked. <laughs> every day is leg day when you're a snake right now. <laughs> Where's he going? <laughs> Where did you say? Oh, he's coming. It's going to. I'm going to help oh, again. Shit. <laughs> It can't reach! No. Oh, God, yeah. oh, that's fucking hilarious! <laughs> it just traversed... His head is underwater. It traversed the length of the map. <laughs> it, just, it, it just sat there so disappointed with itself. Like, it's it's every reach. movement is torture, and yet it crossed the entire length of the map just to stand within uh, oh, one oh, meter oh, of its oh, target. Oh. Kiki, I know you, you have weird fetishes, but please. Buddy is doing something. What the fuck is he doing in my base sudden? Oh yeah, it's metabulate. Oh no, metabulate versus metabulate. This was never meant to be. <laughs> oh, oh my god, a cheapling just running. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. It's funny when um, like really slow creatures have a charge and you yeah. just see them. Yeah. I love when creatures um, die mid hover. I love I love when creatures um, see like an enemy up on a cliff, and they do a charge attack, and it lets them exceed the normal charge attack distance. Yeah. So they can do a charge attack around like half of the map to get to this target. Yeah. <laughs> and sometimes you can be like, you can just be sitting, and you'll just see a, a creature just charge through one of your expansions and just keep going. <laughs> Wait, does it like double the speed? Something like that, yeah. And so you have no idea where it's going, but you know something's about to get fucked up. 
Wait, so you literally can't I just run. imagine a cheapling just running all all around growth just to get back to the same point because there was a creature there. <laughs> Actually, yeah. you know what, Kiki? That's a good question. We should I wonder try... if um, cheetahs could outrun it. Yeah, we should try cheetahs versus a really slow unit with charge attack and see oh, if you can run it. <laughs> Jesus. Leap doesn't work the same way as charge, though. It's just a short yeah. burst. Oh, look at those fucking sharp necks getting it's, taken it's... out. Le Leap is way faster than charge, right? Uh, no, I don't think so. I think Leap is slightly Leap is faster, faster than charge. But it's just like one uh, bur little burst of speed, but charge Leap... is an actual charge. Yeah, Leap yeah, yeah, takes yeah, okay. uh, zero point five seconds to arrive. Yeah, like you can't do that. Well, you can't do this that same thing with Leap, where it runs across the map. And actually, so technically... charge beats Leap if you've got one yeah. versus the other, because the whole deal with both of those things is that. It lets you get the first attack. Yeah, but I thought uh, Leap uh, is guaranteed to get the first attack. No, charge. If you have a Leap and charge, charge gets the first attack. Huh. Oh, the priority? Oh. I believe that's the case. I could be wrong, but that's what Matt told me in Matt's you, word you, is law. You would, you would think that Leap would get the priority, just on, like, logic uh, nope. standpoint. Oh, that's... that's... okay, let me explain what happened there. Buddy is... um... Well, it was raining. And his internet got out, and that's that. Tragically. <laughs> oh. After, after 54 and a half it's... minutes, but... But... Watch okay, what basically happens. what happened is, because when, when someone crashes, the game, like, pauses, and, you know, it hangs. And I thought that Buddy S was going to drop out, so oh, while it was it paused, I queued up some henchmen and had them run across to his base so I could take his geysers before Steve got there. <laughs> <laughs> what if he hadn't dropped? Then I would have probably let them go anyway and had them build creature shamans instead. Look at them really go. Fun. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. Awesome parkour there on the cliffside. Good on your little <laughs> <laughs> it looks so silly with this moving with the speech upgrade. Speed upgrade. Ding, 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 ding. Look, look, look at the look at the one on the mainland. <laughs> Too slow. <laughs> I know uh, exactly what I thought. I was like, oh god fucking damn it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look at What's that. This? Just imagine what those henchmen must be thinking. Our boss wants us to punch metal. Imagine punching metal to actually destroy it. Duh, okay. Luke, <laughs> 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 like with Minecraft, your glorious voice. Punch trees yes. to gather <laughs> Minecraft, do, you have, do you have anything to contribute, Luke? I'm sorry, I was completely distracted. I'm multitasking. Luke, Luke can't even see the game. Leave him alone, you bastard. Well, I don't, I like Luke. That's Ooh. why I asked. Ooh, thank you. Aww. Well, I like Luke, but I feel the intense need to control him. <laughs> Look at that one. It's how I show affection. Uh, <laughs> Whoa! That, 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 that is something. <laughs> I must, I must warn you. Suddenly I'm really scared of Will, forever meeting him again in the well, You're not life. always scared of me. Not always, sure but when I'm suddenly... when we made it suddenly... real life, I used telekinesis to knock over a bike. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was you. That was Sorry, so that... fucking weird. That was actually you, yeah. I, we were like, uh, drinking a cola at a, at a bar. And there were these bikes, like, parked against the church, and I just said, uh, we were joking about, oh, you, uh, you're a Satanist, uh, you know that? And, um... <laughs> no literally said... I want that bike to fall over, and that bike fell over. <laughs> and it over. did. It, that exact <laughs> bike, it fell over. <laughs> and if anyone else needed proof that Humbaba is real and must be praised, there you go. Humbaba the Demon King. That's we, we were fucking astounded by it at first. We were both like sitting with our cola like, what the fuck just happened? The thing is, it was so leaning, the before. bike was leaning against the wall of a church. Yeah. So maybe it's more likely that it was Jesus? Why would Jesus make a bike fall over? Why would Humbaba make a bike fall over? <laughs> Who cares about the bike? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Luke, I care about the bike. It Should was a bike big bike, bike look, it meant, a, it meant a lot to me. Luke's timing is phenomenal. It <laughs> is. Like, coming in at the exact moment that Will says, I have a big bag of dicks. Oh yeah. Great. Big blue bag of cocks. Never really got the opportunity. The, um, how large the range of this frog. It all starts to go a wee bit downhill for Steve from here. 
For some reason, though, because he's claimed the geysers in the base. It was like he's... All... Strangely, the moment I got the geysers was where all my resources just tanked. Yeah, it's weird, right? I think it's because you were also geyser sniping me, so it just sort of negated itself. So. Yeah, it was fun, right? I love that forward effect, like, the train. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. It really fucked me up when, um, when the re-release came out and we all started playing I.I. because the hover does that yeah, little... Yeah, the hover. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's really it's bouncy. Little... Bouncy, yeah. Vibrating and we set it down to, like, zero or something. Because we're sane human beings. Yeah, it looks way better. We should mess around with the hover, uh, hover altitude just for fun though, set it to like, the ceiling of the world. <laughs> and it just goes all the way down, all the way up, up <laughs> and then everybody just thinks that their game is crashing. I want to do that with 250 Heavenly Fathers. <laughs> 100 henchmen running across my GUI. <laughs> <laughs> no, my HUD. Final verdict, that never happened. Yeah. Too many look at this, look at this. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I'm sorry, Grandpa Sharpneck. The thing is, normally, oh, oh, there it's they okay. go. Okay, he's been dead for a long time. <laughs> Aw, I laughed, but I'm sad. It's the same with Marco. Like when he when he went like, no, I only have ten subscribers. That was <laughs> hilarious. Oh my god, I really did. <laughs> No, no, no. Just like, go away. No, he's like, um... I am Dutch, and not really. No, when he was like, you must add me on Facebook, a macro memes. I think it's like the most popular macro memes page. It has 10 subscribers. It used to have 11. Oh, Steve, I like all my memes. I want a screenshot of all of you posting on Mako memes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, nudity is just wrecking the center now. The nudity has been deployed. Yeah, I see them in the distance. <laughs> no, oh, God, Derp. nudity. Look at the barrier destroyer. They destroy sound beam towers in, I think, three hits. Somebody that just watches the uh, like that little huh? snippet of the... It was a fucking car. It just does nothing for a little while. Yeah, it just stares. Yeah, that is because I think we need to add a secondary attack animation for the blue web. Hmm. Yep. Can we? Yeah, of course. Easy, man. I gotcha. We could Can actually we even just use the existing one in the object editor. That's true. I was gonna say, but you don't. We don't have the model, do we? To. Uh, I don't know, I might have lost it. I can Imagine probably just remake terror. it completely honest. It'll take me about 10 minutes. Look at, look at them swim away. What happened last time you made models in 10 minutes, William? <laughs> oh, 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 Jesus. <laughs> oh, yes. The frogs are so great, because the way they just crawl and stumble and just have a terrible time. Just everything they do just looks so uncomfortable. Everything in Steve's <laughs> army is not happy to be alive. <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa Sharpneck loves his life, which is a shame because he's a spam. I think it's just like they have mentally a disorder or something like that. Collective intelligence. So they the legs look so long. Memory. Oh, oh, there goes the hurting. Yeah, great micro. I just like they look so gallant. They say get up and go, and they just trot. They're just like. Da -da 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 -da. I wish we could fix the um the jaggy graphical corruption when we zoom out. I know, I know, but it's the same so, in the army builder. They just the level so of detail is set too low. I know snakes look like piss. The snakes, yeah. But the level of detail is as high as it goes in game. It's level two, isn't it? Yeah, but uh, it just I goes think... when you zoom out. I just like how everything that's combined with a mana war just Goddamn makes it so much bigger engine. when when it gets onto fucking land. Oh yeah, because their tentacles play. Yeah, out. <laughs> one frog over there. Hey, Yabba's here. Oh, by the way, uh, that frog seen some shit. Do you guys have shit. any tips for tier two uh, ranged stuff? Yeah. Oh, um, oh look, another problem. She does some porcupines. <laughs> the cheapest one is um, poison Probably frog. That's fire. the most efficient ranger too. Coyote range. Yeah, coyote. Basically, if you mix a coyote with anything, you can't really go wrong. Cuttlefish coyote. Unless yeah, it doesn't have range. Coyote, yeah. Cheetahs are pretty good. They usually end up for like 
get. They usually end up costing less than 100 coal. Mm. Yeah, cheetos have really low health for the cost, though. Yeah, but they're so speedy, you can micro them. Yeah, you can just pull them in, pull them out, and do hit and run. He's crawling to his death. Oh no! Oh! Oh, no. Christ. That frog had uh, 100 health, and the first hit did 81 damage. That chipling you know didn't what? even have Frenzy or Horns. I mean, Frenzy or Pack, that's all. Especially but. for the for the Swarm deck, there is only one true unit. No, oh, here we go, this is the end. The so down to ranged. How did Steve lose, though? How did I Steve know. lose? I think Will didn't let me attack his last. Look at that shake animation. That, that, honestly, the only reason I won is because of, whoa, that's crazy. That's because the piranhas attack animation has so much wibble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This, is what I'm, see, this is what I'm talking. This is what I'm talking about with like the epileptic rhinos. Look at them <laughs> twitch. Okay, that that is not the rhino. Though. That is piranha. It's not though. Oh, it is piranha. Trust me. I'll show you later. That is uh, the weirdest thing. GG, I, I guess. I don't discovered. Know. Well, let's have... um, let's. So, sorry, Luke, one sec, we'll just end this. Um, yeah. The only reason, the only reason I survived more than, like, 20 minutes is because Steve was a gentleman, and I really should have just died. I deserve death. Will Steve Senpai ever forgive me? Find Steve out. Steve Senpai is punished by death. Not really, but... I